Hey everybody, it's Kane New York YouTube and we're back at you with another Minecraft tutorial. Today we're going to show you how to get your Minecraft Forge working with your Minecraft Magic Launcher. This is our latest updated version for 1.7.4 Minecraft. This is exactly what you got to do. Let's go ahead and get started right now. First, you want to make sure that you have your Minecraft Magic Launcher downloaded and installed on your computer. That's the first thing you want to do. I suggest if you really want to find the Magic Launcher really fast, go and type in in your internet search uh, area up in the top left corner. Type in 9minecraft.net. That is the number 9minecraft.net. Search right on over here to the Minecraft tools, Minecraft 1.7.4 tools. Click on it. It's going to take you right here to this page that you see right now. Click on Magic Launcher. We're going to hurry up and go to the next page. Do not click on this top download link. This one right up here. Don't click on it. Don't click on that. Scroll on down to the bottom. Go to the Magic Launcher download links. Get it for Windows, Mac, Windows, Mac, Linux, whichever one you want to do. Um, we normally download right straight from Server 1. This is exactly what the download link is going to look like. This is the direct download link. Click on the download link. It's going to ask if you want to run or save the Magic Launcher. Normally, I just save it. Then I open up the folder in the file and I run it that way. Or you can drag it just right straight onto the desktop like we have done. Let's see if I can find it right here. There's the Magic Launcher and the Minecraft right there. Next, what you want to do. You've got Magic Launcher already started. Ready to go. Make sure it's dragged onto your desktop. Make sure that your regular Minecraft, your regular Minecraft game is updated to the most recent version of Minecraft so that you can run your mods or make sure it's updated to the version of Minecraft that you're going to be running and playing your mods in. Um, for most mods, it's going to be what, about 1.5.2 and greater for a lot of the uh, more recent mods. So, make sure that you've opened it up. You're ready to play. You're updated. You're good to go. Right now, we're playing in 1.7.4. We're updated to the most recent version. The reason why you want to do this is so that um, there are Minecraft jar files created in your percent app data percent roaming folder for the dot Minecraft. They create new uh, jar file folders so that your mods can be played in them. You cannot play the version of Minecraft until you have your regular Minecraft version updated to the correct one and your jar files are uh, created in your Minecraft folder. This is a, lot of, a little bit of useless kind of lingo, but you have to know it so that you know how to download and install your mods correctly and so that they will play correctly. So next, we're going to go ahead and go right straight on over to files.minecraftforge.net and download and install the latest version of the Minecraft Forge. The latest actually is 1.7.2, but a lot of the um, mods aren't working with them yet, or there's there's very few mods so far. So what I would suggest to do right now um, is go to where there's a lot of mods at. Right now it's 1.6.4, that's right even at the top. Go ahead and do it on the latest area right here under the promotions type spot. 1.6.4 and click on the installer. Don't click on anything else. Installer. Click on installer. It's going to do the same thing. Ask if you want to. Um, it's going to bring you to the ad five page. Of course, every time it gets me. Stay on this page. And now it's telling me my are made. What are you doing to me? That's right. We're skipping right past it. Your download will be ready. If it tells you your cookies are, are disabled, screw that. Refresh the page. Make sure you skip the ad. And then it's going to uh, then it's gonna prompt you. Do you want to save or open uh, Minecraft Forge installer.jar from files.minecraftforge.net? Go ahead and click save. Um, open the folder area. Or open the, the Minecraft file itself. Actually, I don't think you can um, to start with for the Minecraft board. What are you going to have to do with that? Let's see if I've already found it here. 
Yep, yeah, I've already got it. All right, ready to go. You're gonna go right into your download download area, click on the Minecraft Forge installer, make sure that you're opening it with the Java TM platform SE binary. That'll open up the client, the install client, and then Minecraft Forge install client. Go ahead and click on OK. That's gonna install Minecraft Forge, whichever version it is that you happen to install for Minecraft Forge. It's gonna install it for Minecraft. And then after done that, you can verify that it was downloaded and installed in your Minecraft by typing in and down here in the bottom left hand corner of your screen at the Windows Start icon. Go ahead and go in there in that search program and files part, type in percent app data. That is the actual percent sign, app data percent. And that's gonna bring up your roaming folder. So I'm gonna go actually go ahead and do that for you, even though I've already got the folder up. App data percent. And it bring it brought up my roaming folder. And then right here at the top, or it could be it could be anywhere in your roaming folder. Um, look for dot minecraft. Go down here into versions, and when you go into versions, you're gonna go and you're gonna see Minecraft 1.6.4 forge right here. Some people have to change the IDs on the Minecraft Forge, but this time I did not for the uh, Minecraft launcher. So you've got Minecraft Forge done and ready. Make sure that you have created a mod folder as well. Um, you wanna go ahead and do that by creating a mod, a mod jar itself, or you can go right and create your own mod folder by clicking on the folder, naming it mods, putting your mods in there, in the dot minecraft, okay? Now you're ready to go ahead and get this bad boy installed. Now, when you open up Magic Launcher, we're going to go ahead and, and delete out of all of those right now. We're gonna go ahead and go into Magic Launcher. We've done everything that we need to do in Minecraft. Minecraft regular launcher is done. We're worried about Magic Launcher now. Sometimes, actually, you know what? No, I I'm just kidding. Minecraft, you wanna go ahead and run Minecraft first, your regular Minecraft. Make sure that the Forge is working in your regular Minecraft and updated and regular ready to play. We've got our Forge set in a different, a different profile. And when Minecraft Forge is working with its mods, you can download your mods from 9minecraft.net as well. Just go into the little modding area, um, the, the modding search area. Download your mod, mods from the version that you want to install to 1.6.4. A lot of the it's got a lot of the um, Minecraft mods right now. A lot of the other ones don't. Uh, 1.7.4 has very few mods right now. 1.6.4 has the most mods at this time. This is January 8th of 2014, and 1.6.4 has the most mods as of right now. So as you can see, Minecraft Forge is running for us. Minecraft 1.6.4, we've got the versions, we've got all the good stuff. It's showing us all of our mods that we've got loaded into our list. Um, there's gonna be certain particular ones that you want to get like code chicken core, uh, not, a knife, not enough items, not a knife items, not enough items, and like raise mini map, I don't even have raise mini map, but I've been needing to get it, and I've been forgetting to get it, that's, that's a big problem, I really need it, alright, so, we've got our mods, it's working, it's updated, it's ready to play, go ahead and exit right on out of there, go into your magic launcher, run it, open it up, do what you gotta do with it, Boom, you're right there. Go to your setup. Go to your configuration. Make sure that you're playing it in the version that you've got Minecraft Forge downloaded for. Ours is downloaded for 1.6.4. You can just click right here at that and drop it down to 1.6.4, but if it's not there available for the configuration in your little drop down, don't freak out. Just go ahead and click new. Type in 1.6.4 for your configuration. In your environment, you should see the 1.6.4 Forge pop right up. Boom, there you have it. It shows you the Minecraft jars. 
you're ready to run, it's going to come right down here. You can either add your mods in from your mod folder, or if you've got it in the external uh, mod folder like we do for Minecraft, it's going to come right down here at the bottom. It all works. It's all the same. It's going to say okay for most of the status. Sometimes there's certain things that are deleted or I've had to install a different way. Go ahead and click on OK. Go log in, sign your name in, sign your regular Minecraft account information in right here, or you can play offline as a guest. We like to play online. Magic Launcher normally takes a couple seconds longer for uh, Minecraft to launch, it seems like, than the regular launcher. But it does the justice and it's just as quick. No problems at all. We're waiting for it to start up. It's getting there. And there you have it. The Minecraft 1.6.4 started in Magic Launcher working with Minecraft Magic Launcher. This is version 1.6.4. You can see all of our mods that we got right in here ready to go. We're done. We're going to go ahead and open on up one of our worlds. Just in case you didn't know, we are a big time uh, Skylander and Disney Infinity family gaming page, but we like to play Minecraft and we like to play Minecraft modded all the time. And we're using a modded version right now. We've got a morph. Let's see. We're going to be a spy. Which one do we want to be? We want to be an Enderman? Yeah, we'll be an Enderman. And as you can see, all of our mods are working right now. Let's see, did I just, did I morph into him? I can't tell. We've got the not enough items working for us right now. We've got all kinds of mods in here. Let's see if we can find, let's, let's spawn somebody. Who do we want to spawn? We gotta go into our miscellaneous. And we're gonna spawn a mutant, mutant zombie. Uh oh, I'm scared of this. <laughs> Let's get ready. We got a mutant zombie getting ready to be spawned right here. Run. That's got nothing. Oh, I know where I'm going to. Let's go to our monster hunter items. And then we're going to go ahead and get our Warhammer. Monster Hunter is another really cool mod for Minecraft. You'll find that on 9minecraft.net. All right, let's go ahead and spawn this bad boy. Ready? Oh, there he is! Ah! Let's kill him! Kill him! Kill him! Get him out of here! We're playing Minecraft Launcher version 1.6.4 with Minecraft Forge in the game. You've seen it at Caden Yurk YouTube. Now make sure that you slap that like button and don't forget to mash down on that subscribe button Leave your comments down below if you're having any difficulties at all, and we'll try to get back to you as soon as we can with answers or help. Thanks for watching, everybody. Don't forget to please like, comment, and subscribe for more Minecraft tutorials, Minecraft, and all kinds of other family fun game. <laughs>